Hello and welcome back to Welcome to Deponia. Uh, this is episode 12. Last episode we met up with Cletus um, and fooled Argus into thinking we were Cletus with a fake disguise that we made it. Made it? Made? Um, using the mop and a few other bits and pieces. Uh, now, uh, we went back to go grab gold to give him give her to Cletus and she's missing so let's um, continue on. Now, I wonder, did I miss anything uh, in the things? So this will probably be the uh, last episode that we have. Um, must be a Do that with this, maybe. If this we empty. A one fish of the day, please. Ugh. Ugh. I should have said which day. Okay. Uh, I wonder can we put this on the? Since we can use the other one with Machine the cutting handy. Create a new flavor from this. I hate gadgets that only do what they were designed for. Machine. All right. Gadgets. Apparently not. Um, do we, like, oh, there we go. Aha, uh -huh. a phrase that seemed to go. Well, don't worry, babe. Uh, can we dip okay, this? let's give it another try. My bad. Uh, can we dip this in the puddle? Oh, we can. Cool. Um, uh, well, let's go out here. That's very loud. So yeah, um, <clears throat> I guess we'll just use this on the trace again, and boom, all the way down here. All right. So I did look up uh, about how long we've got left in this game, and this will probably be the last episode. Might be a little bit longer, but uh, yeah, it's almost over. Um, back out here. Why do I feel like we need this stuff later? Um, alright. Trace all the way in there. Alright. Can we use the lamp on this though? Let what would there that be do? Light. Oh, now it's glowing. Um, Alright, so we've got the backup, some other glowing, oops, other glowing stuff. Let's go through the fence, I guess. The trace ends at this fence. The trace... Can I just manhand... Oh, I can just manhandle it. Alright, uh... A pile of... Who throws out something like that? Can we... Well, free choice. Ouch! Not this one. Ouch! Oh, gosh! Huh. This one respects me. I'll take it. Hey, this isn't a syringe at all. <laughs> I've literally found the straw in a needle stack. Who else can claim such a thing about himself? Okay, um... Sure, why not? Oh, that... Water looks disgusting. No great in the world can hold me back. Uh, I guess we'll just use the light on the phosphor trace again. Yeah, I mean, not really anywhere else we could go. Let's open up this grating, I guess. A monster must have abducted Goal. No normal human being could open that with bare hands. Uh... Okay, what about if we do this? Yeah, there we go. That's cool. I've got to get through all right, but by cleaning up? Oh, looks like somebody doesn't want to be followed. I am like herpes. A uh. cool version of herpes. 
whatever you say, mate. Um, can we hang that? Here, fishy, 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 Since fishy, the, fishy. It's a fish and that's a whale. Here I am, behind the cracked window. Um, <laughs> stupid animal. I guess it's a bit weird. Doesn't look like at all like a fish, but hey. Cool. Uh, we found a boat, some bats, uh, a harmless trawler. The perfect disguise for pirates and slave traders. Uh, there's a chest here. Let's go see if we can. Ah, oh, locked. Distrustful bunch, these pirates. I uh, know, right? We definitely didn't just try to steal. Not a chance. I'll hang on to it till my last breath. Okay. Well, let's uh, go inside, I guess. Oh, look, it's Duck. Well, and who do we have here? Another guy. <laughs> Welcome to Bozo's Trash Trawler. I'm Bozo. Don't shoot! I'm unarmed! What? I don't want to shoot you. Listen, I don't want any trouble. I'll just get my girlfriend and we'll leave. No reason to get violent. So, that's the illusion you were talking about? Doc, what are you doing here? Did this pirate kidnap you too? Don't worry, I'll save you. What's that supposed to mean? I'm not a pirate, and I didn't kidnap anyone either. Well, that was easy. Yeah, I haven't got much time. I need to keep the Organon from blowing up Deponia. What? Why should the Organon blow up Deponia? I, uh, no, I can't tell you uh, anymore. I'm on the track of a conspiracy of enormous proportions. I, uh, <clears throat> I can't get you involved in all this. You don't know yourself, do you? Well, that's, <laughs> that's confidential, too. All I can tell you is this. I have to find a way to wake up Goal. Well, then you've come aboard the right trawler. I know a lot about brain implants. Just like me. I guess the cartridge was damaged. Hand it over for a second. Um... Just press the eject button. Hey, keep away or you'll board... Pain train? Who do you think I am? Just wanted to help you. Yeah, whatever. Come on. Uh... Easy. Uh, almost dropped it. Hold your horses, young man. Such a cartridge has to be handled with loving care. One scratch, and your girlfriend is nothing but organic waste. Don't worry, she's in good hands. Do you have the cartridge? Sure do. There you go. That was the complicated part, right? Stop joking and show me. You better not accidentally trip. Ah, yes. What's your diagnosis? Um, the battery's down? Well, in that case, there's nothing we can do. We should scrap the thing and... Wait a minute. You're just messing with me, aren't you? It's just some dust on the contact pins. That's all. Yeah, and you totally fell for it. Well, this shouldn't be a problem at all. Clean the pins and reinsert it. You mean I should dust? You sound like my ex-girlfriend. Did you scrap her, too, because her battery was down? Something like that, yeah. All right. Do we just like Gold's memory is stored on it? Caution advised. Hmm. Ah, well, that's just a tiny speck of dust. We'll have that cleaned up in no time. Um. Dusty. Clean. Clean. I uh, don't have anything, I guess, to do it. Um, Alright. I wouldn't take that feather <laughs> duster. I use it to clean the tanks. Oh, sounds promising enough. If you can clean a tank with it, then it must work twice as well for a measly cartridge. I know what I'm doing. Mm, do we, though? Somehow I doubt it. Hey. You've stolen my key. And you have kidnapped my girlfriend. Oh, she was not kidnapped. And I can put her back out into the cold if you prefer. And how are you going to do that all without a key? Not a problem. 
my door is always open. So, you shouldn't be wondering when things get stolen around here all the time. I mean, technically she was kidnapped, but... You know. Uh, details, right? Uh, okay. So... Alright, well, let's go out then. This key's probably... Fit. The chest. Somehow I have there. a feeling we need Open. this. Let's get rid of the key. What have we here? A small brush, miniature bellows, a sealed pack of hand wipes. Pfft, what useless junk. I want to clean a cartridge, not refurbish a doll's house. Ah, yes. This looks much uh, better. He definitely is in a brush. Lit. Yeah, we're... And a bottle of degreaser. I'll, uh, leave the girly stuff. Well, we're gonna, um... We're going to fuck up this cartridge, I guess. Oh, ugh. The duster has dusted everything with dust. And... Oh, oh no. I'll have to give it to one... Alright, then we can what grease. Mess. This doesn't have to be clean yet. Oh, hold on. Maybe I should have washed my hands. Hope it's supposed to be like this. And grease it. Hope it's supposed to be like this. Whoa! Corroded, dusty, and corroded. Hope it's supposed to be like this. What a mess. Oh no, this is beyond. <laughs> Good thing. <laughs> the cartridge is filled. Time of. The cartridge time for <laughs> the cartridge time for Ta da Ta da Ta da oh. Good as new And those scratches could have come from anywhere. Yeah, except for the one so, that says Did you clean the contact pins yet? Um, yep. All clean and G. shiny. Very good. Show me. Just a minute. Did this have those scratches before? What? Oh, those. I noticed them before. Inconceivable how those young ladies treat their brain implants these days, isn't it? Yes. And they don't even have to eject them from their drives, either. Inconceivable. Well, a couple of scratches. They can't be too grave, can they? Talking about grave, has someone engraved his name and a little heart on there? Um, you better give that back. It'll work just fine. Well, it has to. He's not wrong. It's the only thing with the uh, ascension codes on it. Hey, she's awake. What? Where am I? Cletus? Is that you? No. Give me a second. You are Rolfi. Rufus. I recognize you. I was <coughs> they called. And then, I remember, the hospital ward. There were other people too. Deponians! So it is true. Deponia is inhabited. The Organon lied to us. I have to contact Cletus. Well, uh, that's almost a good idea. <laughs> Just almost, unfortunately. Your oh-so-wonderful fiancé is in cahoots with the Organon. Cletus is... What? Ah, uh, my head. Maybe you should sit down first. But I'm already sitting. Don't worry, baby. I'll explain everything. Mm. Your implant was malfunctioning. Your fall from the Organon cruiser damaged it. The Organons pushed me off the cruiser? Well, yes. Thank junk. I could fix everything. Actually, it was me who supervised the repairs. Yeah, of course he did, Gramps. <laughs> Everyone wants a slice of acknowledgement. And now everything's all right. And now everything's all right. And now everything's all right again. Exactly. Um. I saved you. I can hardly remember anything. Not even how I saved you from the clutches of the Organon? There was this conveyor belt. And hey... You were there too. 
You were operating those levers. Or how I nursed you back to health. I, I remember a, a stinging taste on my tongue. And how I carried you halfway around the planet. Well, wait a minute. Wasn't there a crane? Well, obviously, you don't remember anything. Well, be that as it may, you can thank me later. Um, Cletus is a traitor, I Cletus guess. Cletus is a traitor. He's collaborating with the Organon. Of course he is. The Organon is our escort on our reconnaissance mission. Yes, uh, of course, but somehow Ulysses has convinced him to falsify his report. He'll advise the Council of the Elders to blow up Deponia. Despite the planet being inhabited. The monster. Exactly. Uh. The Organon wants to destroy Deponia. I know that. That's why Cletus and I came here, to see if Deponia was really uninhabited. But people do live here, and Ulysses wants to hide the fact, so that he can blow up Deponia anyway. We must stop him at all costs. Uh, I agree. I agree. All right, that's everything we Enough need to worry talking. about. We have to prevent the Organon from destroying Deponia. It'd be best if you took me along to Elysium. Then we could tell your people the truth, and everything will be fine, right? Right. Uh, for real? You're taking me along? To Elysium? Why wouldn't I? All we need is a perfect plan. <laughs> hey, you're talking to the right uh, man. No. Perfect plans are my specialty. Okay, shoot. Um. We should fix. We can easily find everything we need for that in the trash heaps. For the kerosene, we'll milk the Organon cruiser. After that, we'll just need a large slingshot and several tons of raw rubber. Wouldn't it be easier to pass you off as Cletus? You bear a striking resemblance to him. Uh, well, I don't know. My body is much better toned. We'll overpower him and go back to Elysium together. Oh, that could work. Yeah, it's a good thing I thought of that. And what about us? Oh, you... Don't worry. When Elysium is informed that there's still life on Deponia, they'll call the demolition off. Yeah, and we'll be on Elysium. We'd be heroes. And everybody will be happy. Exactly. Well, what are we waiting for? Cool. Her eyes are a bit weird, but you know, I'm sure she's fine. We are going back, I guess. We need to go. Uh, let's let's quickly uh, talk to her. All right. Never better. I have never been better. Never been better. Never been better. Never been better. Better. Thanks for everything, Rufus. Ah, oh, not a problem. But we're not in Elysium yet. Let's uh, hurry, okay? I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's. All right. We'll walk up this way. Wonder, does she have uh, like? You doing all right? <laughs> Never be I have ne never, ne never been better. Thank okay, not a but we're not. A Let's hurry. <laughs> she doesn't have unique dialogue for each area. All right, front of the tower. Oh, that's. Uh oh. That's Argus and his officials. Quick. Take cover. Again, we are searching for a Deponian male and a tall Elysian female. We found their traces, so we know that they must still be nearby. If you find them, arrest them at once. The Elysian must not be eliminated. The Deponian, on the other hand, may. Hey, did you hear that? Yeah, I guess I'm too much of a threat to them. Why? Is he too much of a threat to us? No, don't worry. He's just in our way. Hey. Get to work, men. There must be someone in the compound. Keep an eye on that gate. Don't let them escape. All right. They obviously have no idea who they're dealing with. Stay down. I'll show them the meaning of he's just in our way. Go get him, Tiger. Uh, hold on. Do I... Can I take, uh, this thing back? No, it doesn't look like it. All right. Let's have a look-see. Is this acid or water? Just water. That's probably for the best, since you just, like, stuck your whole ass hand in it. One step closer, and mayhem will ensue. I'd rather spare them the pain. All right, what do we have? Uh, straw. Hmm. Brilliant. I'll finally get rid of this nasty taste. <laughs> okay, new mission. Do that. 
Can I? Uh, do we just eat the glowing? Gently in the dark. Okay, stick. Not a chance. I'll hang on to it. I should be more careful with. Who knows if there's? I don't need life. I saw it. Hey. All right. And. I don't have to fish in small bodies of water. I don't have to fish. My old boots are still in. <clears throat> okay. Hmm. Not sure. One step close. I'd rather spare them. Not sure exactly how we're supposed to do this. The organons are standing almost those morons. Enough laughter for now. I. Yeah. Torch light. That's yeah, bright enough in here. One step. I'd rather spare. Hmm. Let's see. Mm. All right. Um. Cool. Pretty deep and bright. Might be the nuclear reactor down there. If it's deep, maybe we can just breathe through the straw. Oops. Uh, swim and like do the whole breathe through a straw thing. I in hope the goal is watching this. In this every. This is something that I'll only do once. Was it in like every movie ever? Uh, yeah, there we are. Go through the trunk. Ow! What was that? Did you hear that too? Sounded pretty miserable. Yes, it did. Well, I don't think we need to be frightened of an animal that makes sounds like that. It's probably physically challenged. <laughs> Crap. As long as the top is down, I can't make out anything in here. Um. I'll save my telecat. I'll save my tele. Do we got to swap windows? Ow! I'll save my tele. And now we come up here. Ow! As long as it. Um, do we like. throw the fork? Um. No. Ow! Ow! This stick. I'll save my. T I'll save my. T um. Hmm. What do we need to do here? Ow! As long as the top. Yeah. Uh, can I maybe combine these? Spikes or rivets, oh, but a fork? I don't need... I saw it every... Hey! Um, right. Um, hmm. Let's go back here, I guess. I'll save my tele... Can we, like, eat the f I'll save my tele- um. <laughs> The bone-shattering honking will knock them out cold. Uh, which brings us to plan B. Can I, like, just- What was that? No, that was not a cat. That was something big. A cow! A cow must be entangled in this pile of junk! So it would seem. Ch stupid animal. Whew. It's a good thing I'm always thinking on my feet. They're not the brightest, are they? It's probably for the best, considering we are also not. No, forget it. There's nothing there. Um. 
I can't get any clothes. The organons would. Do I like? They'd make a great trio, but two jokers standing in my way. Finally, I can get over there with. Um, hmm. Eh, it'll be a piece of. Now I... Hello? Hello, who's that? You're paranoid, Tuesday. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. Easy. <laughs> Alright. We get there eventually. That wasn't half bad. Hey, half bad is my second name, babe. Stop calling me that. Oh, uh, come on. We need to hurry. All right, I guess we need to run up to the Ascension Station. With my fake... My Cletus costume. Stop! Who goes there? It's me, Cletus, accompanied by my charming fiancé, Gold. Finally! I was afraid she'd already eloped with that disgusting deponium. What a bizarre thought. Oh, contraire, Buttercup. Don't be afraid to admit. Very understandable. On the contrary, Honey Bunny. That's enough! Oh, yeah, finally! Very well. Now, I need to talk to you in private, Ambassador. Uh... Of, of course. <clears throat> Why don't you scuttle on ahead, darling? Me and the bailiff have urgent matters to discuss. <laughs> Seemingly. B but... Shoo-shoo, sugar. <laughs> if you insist, <laughs> so we'll see each other in a short while, then. Toodaloo. Have you lost your mind completely? I thought we had an agreement. The memories of Ms. Gold must be deleted. And we need the Ascension Codes. Don't panic. I'm working on it. I'll swap the cartridges and uh, leave the original on the platform. That, that, that should make everyone happy, right? Yes, everyone except for the Deponiums. <laughs> <laughs> if you try anything funny, I'll personally decapitate you with a rusty knife. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. All right. Let's, uh... Go upstairs, I guess. We didn't get that back, but that's fine. We go to the platform, um, and we should be. You can't be serious. People are living here, Cletus. I've seen them with my own eyes. I already told you. Ulysses is right. We can't. Am I interrupting? Rufus, finally, I was about to throw this ignorant idiot from the tower. Don't ask me why I fancied him in the first place. What are you doing, Rufus? I thought we had an agreement. Think again, Cletus. I'll go to Elysium with Gaul. <laughs> this is a joke, right? Please, go. tell me that this is a joke. It's not a joke. Rufus will come to Elysium with me. He'll help me to tell everyone the truth about Deponia. Ha <laughs> ha! And you really believe they'll grant someone like him access to Elysium? Why not? Everyone will think it's you. Him? Don't make me laugh. Hmm. Give it up, Cletus. What's this? You're unleashing your lice upon me. Don't make me laugh. All right. Um... Do I have to get angry first? Are you threatening me? Listen, bub. I've got the third ascat in the art of Shwekulu. Yeah, just like I do. Oh, yeah? What's your dojo? Uh, five? Five? I mean, uh, yellow. Fire? Capricorn? Ocelot? Damn. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. Besides, that doesn't sound even remotely like me. 
I think he does quite a good impression of you. Huh. Be that as it may, this one-man flea circus will never pass for me. Look at the way he dresses. Disgusting. You two go ahead and sort it out between you. But, Rufus... <laughs> and you're planning to elope to Elysium with a wimp like that? Don't make me laugh. Rufus has more in his head than you have. Yes, and I'm sure you could feed three horses with it. I'm gonna At least Rufus is fighting for something he believes in. Oh, you what mean he's fighting here? for the Easter Bunny? A second Bunny. disguise. Let's see who's the better Cletus. <laughs> so we just... Yeah, well... Almost as good as my handmade disguise. Ha <laughs> ha! The inventory in these rags is ridiculously small. You can't even fit a bucket and mop in there, let alone a parrot and two cats. <laughs> I'll put my stuff here for now. Rufus is miles ahead of you. Yes, especially in the department All right, of that's body enough. odor. <laughs> so this is the wimp you want to replace me with. Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. Besides, that doesn't sound even remotely like me. I think he does quite a good impression of you. Huh. Be that as it may, this one-man flea circus will never pass for me. He can try and put on my clothes all he wants and infest them with bugs. There is still one thing where I'm completely different. Oh, my. Your sagging butt cheeks? <laughs> My birthmark, you dumbass. Yeah, what are you doing? Ouch! No, don't! Yeah! We did it! We really did it! Towards Elysium! Not so fast, buddy. What was the agreement that Cletus was talking about? What? Oh, that. Forget it. That's all toxic waste under the bridge. Let's see. Let's go. To Elysium! Wait a minute. That's it, right? You don't even care about what happens to Deponia. You just want to get to Elysium, whatever the cost. Me? No! What a change of attitude. He sounded quite different earlier. Deponia stinks. Only idiots live here. If it were up to me, they could blow the whole place sky high. Yada, yada, yada. You keep out of this. Don't believe a word he's saying, Gull. He just wants to drive us apart. But how do I know I can trust you? Trust this rat. Don't make me laugh. Gull, he hates Deponia. He's an egomaniac, a thief. And a traitor. Just go through his things. I'm pretty sure you'll find a backup cartridge, just in case you realize what he's up to. He wouldn't do that. Well, go ahead. Have a look. Go. Well, Don't. shit. I mean... Go. Listen. You don't understand. I think I understand very well. You know, Rufus, I really thought you were something special. But I am something special. I know you think that, but you're nothing but an egotistical scoundrel. You don't only resemble Cletus on the outside. Come over here. I want to take a good look at you before I return to Elysium alone, so I can remember what kind of a face not to fall for yet a third time. Do we have to just like... I'm... I'm sorry. <laughs> Bother! What next? Argus! About time, too! Get me down from here! Why should I? From the start, you've been jeopardizing our plans, Cletus. Rufus, on the other hand... You can't be serious! You're not saying you trust this lying rat more than me! Why not? He is indeed a lying rat. Hey. But that's what makes him the perfect man for the job. He'll be celebrated as a hero in Elysium. And he'll get the girl. He'll get everything he ever dreamed of. Do you really think he'd risk all that just to save his home that he loathes so much? He's not man enough to do that. Once Gold sees his true self, he'll lose everything he tried to achieve. He'll never take that risk. Congratulations, Rufus. You did it. Just insert the backup cartridge and you can leave. Elysium awaits you. What? 
What's going on? Is that? You want me to roll for a while? No, no, don't worry. I know that you need to go easy on your back. And once we're back on Elysium, I'll give you a nice back rub, okay? I guess so. Come on, don't make such a gloomy face. In a way, it's a good thing that our inspection was without results. Ah. Uh. I can't remember everything. Or was there something else? Um. Come on, how about a bit more enthusiasm towards Elysium and all that? Yes? No? Um. What's wrong? Is there something you'd like to tell me? Aren't you happy to be going back to Elysium? I am. It's just that... Well then, towards Elysium, right? Um... Say goal. Yes? Um... Well, it's like this. I'm all is. Well... What are you stammering about? Come Get on. it out. <clears throat> it's just that... You're beginning to scare me. What's wrong with you? All right, then. I'm going to tell you now. But you have to promise not to get mad. Why, Cletus? Why would I get mad at you? Oh, honey. And we're here again. Calm down. Relax. Relax. Some con man erases my memory, poses as my fiance, and almost gets me involved in a genocide, and I'm supposed to relax. I, I told you about it, didn't I? I mean, I'm the, I'm the good guy. You'll be the dead guy if you don't return my old memories. But that'd be suicide. Believe me, buddy, not doing it would be suicide. Okay, okay. And now remove this fragment of pseudo-personality from my brain. And don't even think about inserting it again. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Ungrateful... Ooh. Fortunately, the goal on the other cartridge likes me a bit mm. more. Not so much. But, you know. Okay, we've just got the back up. Check the bag. Ugh. Lace underwear for men. <laughs> he can keep those. All right, let's uh, go down, I guess. Oh. <clears throat> Looks like this is, in fact, a marathon episode. I thought we were a lot closer this to that. go faster. We need those codes. Yes, Bonif. You do know what's at stake. If Ulysses had had his way, we'd all perish here on Deponia. Yes, Bailiff. Any problems here? No, Prime Controller, sir. Just a relay that short-circuited. This matter is of no concern now. I want to address the crew before we head on to Portofisco. Immediately. As you wish, Prime Controller. You heard the man. Get moving! Yeah, leave. So I can steal the thing back. It's uh, now or never. There we go. All right, let's. We're obviously going to take back uh, her cartridge. Uh, what if we put the backup one in no there? No time. They could be back any. All right. <laughs> this device bears a striking resemblance to Cletus. <laughs> no time. They could be back. All right. Well. Ooh. Come on. <laughs> to the elevator. Hello. Oh, he's got a gun. Surprised, are we? I bet you thought you finally made it, huh? Lady Luck loves the righteous, so on and so forth, right? Well, think again, buddy. It's almost ironic. For once in your life, you decide to do the right thing, and immediately you lose everything. <laughs> your dream turns into a nightmare. The love of your life is lost, and your home planet gone. <laughs> I would really love to pity you now, but the cable boat is ready, and the ascension codes have been entered. I don't want to let Elysium wait for me any longer. After all, they're expecting a report from me. I could have left already, by the way, but 
How shall I put it? My back is troubling me. I don't want to do all the rowing by myself. So, hand over the cartridge. Now, Gull's memories about your failed attempt to mess with my plans should still be stored in her short-term memory. I can delete that in a minute. Hand it to me! Ha! <laughs> you wish! What is going ah, on here? The Organon. Always on time, always reliable. I guess I owe you an apology. That rat didn't swallow your cheese, Bailiff. But I'm not an unforgiving person. Once Rufus hands over the cartridge, we'll be able to carry out our scheme as planned. Now more than ever. You heard him, Rufus. Give him the cartridge now. Come on, Rufus. Be reasonable. I will return to Elysium no matter what. You can't change that. But if you hand over the data, you'll at least have a chance at saving goal. So, what do you say? Do we have an agreement? Um... Let's talk it over, I well, guess. Let's talk this over. And why, pray tell, should I listen to you? I just want the cartridge. Nothing else. Never. Never. Well, I guess I'll have to row myself then. Too bad. But I should have known that your pride is more important to you than Goal's life. <laughs> I bet you already figured out a nice lie to tell her when she wakes up and then realizes that you've brought her a front row seat for Armageddon. Ah, uh, wait a minute. No, 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 don't waste my time. Give me the cartridge or don't. <laughs> All right. Fine. We'll give okay, him the cartridge. You win. Here's the cartridge. <laughs> How unusually reasonable of you. <laughs> and I bet that Goal would be thankful too. Unfortunately, she will never know that you even existed. My, my, my. Deponio will make such a great display of fireworks for our wedding. <laughs> yeah, sure. I hate that guy. Lucius? What? What happened? Um, a lot. Uh, uh, can't you remember anything at all? Of course I can remember. I... I... um... We two were on board an Organon cruiser. We wanted to inspect Deponia, right? We're on Deponia now. Our mission is over. Did I fall asleep? There, there was an accident. You fell from the cruiser. That's why you can't remember anything. But take a look around. Deponia really is deserted. Uh. Unbelievable. Nothing but junk. Yes, just junk. Nothing else. Come, let's go home to Elysium. We have to prepare our wedding. Yes, let's go. Well, that's that, I guess. I'll be on my way, too. The way home to Kuvak is long, and I need to prepare for the apocalypse. Not so fast, Sonny. You didn't think we'd let you leave just like that. You know too much. Also, I believe you have something that belongs to us. Oh yes, the cartridge. Hmm. Give it to me. What is it? What are you waiting for? Oops. No! <laughs> So long, suckers! Run, boy! What? No! Get that traitor! Shoot him! Well, my friend, did you lose something? The cartridge! Uh, bravo, Prime Controller, sir! All right, um, well, I mean, I feel like the only thing we can do See is you just later. No, stop. Hey. What are you doing? Stop, stop, stop. Ah, you damn fool, let go! Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> we really win. Oof, right into the needles. Huh. Bozo. Back so soon. <laughs> that was a pretty impressive fall. And you managed to land in the pile of needles. Never seen anything like it. You have my respect. 
we're basically invulnerable. We just fell like all right, kid. You seem so far, and we're fine. <laughs> we just thumbs up. We're all good. There. The course is set. Next stop, the floating black market. Good. Great. Fine. Are you alright, Rufus? You sound all tuckered out. You didn't finish telling me what happened up there on the tower. I don't want to be nosy, but... Uh, is Deponia safe? That's out of my hands now. Now look at you startled, the brain implant cartridge has not been swapped, which was all part of the plan. A world has been rescued that he did detest, who'd have guessed, I attest, you'd have done just the same. So if you still want to force me to do stupid chores, like washing the dishes to the trash and such, you'll just prove that you haven't paid attention to what I said. The message at its course like, huzzah as a rule. Huzzah, the chorus guys rule. on Deponia and goodbye Deponia and maybe one other one um but yeah we'll be on to those next uh while these credits play out um but yeah I was not expecting that much left but hey that's how it goes right um uh, yeah lots of very talented people working on this game um I don't know. I don't really have a lot else to say. Um, it was a good little twist at the end that he didn't actually swap the cartridges. Uh, yeah, I like the the uh, the story. Some of the puzzles were a bit of a pain, but you know that's how you are sometimes when you're not the best at puzzles. Um, things really go. Ugh. So yeah. Um, no, I guess, yeah, not much else to say. Um, finally finishing the first game uh, on this channel. That's a bit of a, bit of a strange one. Now, uh, took 13, or oh, 12 episodes, sorry, not 13. Um, uh, well, it would be 13 if I decided to cut it, but, you know, we'll just leave it as one big one uh, for the finale and we're still going oh, lots and lots of people looks like um, but yeah so we'll be on to uh, the next game um, it'll be the next one in the series which is either Chaos on Deponia or Goodbye Deponia um, I think it's Chaos is next um, but yeah, we'll do that, and then we can continue on. Continue the story of our uh, brave Rufus trying to save Deponia from exploding. And uh, meet up with Goal. So, yeah. Thank you all for watching, uh, and I will see you guys in the next one.